The sleek elegance of this 1922 Model B ideal sewing machine reflects the growing trend towards the Art Deco movement of the early 1920s. Considering her beauty, it's surprising these machines were only produced for one year. The initial Model A, released in May of 1921, was plagued with design errors. While the later Model B addressed these problems, by then the machine's reputation was tarnished. Another problem was quality control with the machine's appearance. On this unit, the horizontal arm looks great, but the vertical plate that supports it has many casting flaws that could easily have been ground out, but weren't. This was a common problem, as can be seen by looking at online images of these machines. It's difficult to market a machine that has obvious defects while still brand new. One final issue was the question about for whom the machine was intended. Halfway in price and size between toys and full-size machines, many prospective buyers may have been confused about which it was. All of these factors combined to doom the ideal to a short life, with the result that they're rare today, especially ones with their protective cover. Research on sales over the last 10 years suggests that only one or two come up for sale per year. Sadly, most are in poor condition and have damaged or missing parts. The most common are the thread spool, the thread tensioner, and the stitch regulator. That this is a Model B is most easily established by the presence of the engraved needle bar cover and an adjustable walking foot. To thread, bring the thread from the spool over through this guide, through the hole on the top of the needle bar, three quarters of a turn around and underneath the tensioning disc, down to this guide, and through the needle from left to right. With the bright nickel plated finish and streamlined design, ideals are a lot of fun to sew on, and even after a hundred years still produce a great little chain stitch. I hope you enjoyed this video of this ideal sewing machine, and as always, thanks for watching.